First and foremost, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Baha Hashem, Yahweh Shah, Baha Hashem, Rakakadash. Secondly, I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS that do rule well. Peace, love, hope, and salutations to the whole four elect that scattered across the four corners of the earth where Yahweh Bashim El Shah has placed you at. Shalom to you, I can walk there, risking your life and your freedom to preach this gospel and this good news via highways and byways or via the internet. Shalom to you, right? And for now, no, I'm going to say, um, instead of saying the confusion to face Israelites, I'm just going to say, you know, Shalom to all the Israelites scattered abroad because I actually had an Akim that corrected me on the um, confusion to face Israelite thing I was saying, you know, and Shalom to that Akim and thank you, the water brother. You know, shalom to you sincere Agua out there and sincere children, okay? This is the brother Micah from the tribe of Judah 144. Coming at you again with another quick lesson. Operat the Zod, which means Lord willing, this lesson is edifying, okay? Today's lesson is going to be about agree with our adversary, right? Agree. Because in the day and age that we're living in, let me just... Say this. I believe like 65%, maybe 75% of altercations between, you know, our people and police can be avoided if they was just to agree with it. If he tells you to, it's like this, you know, police tell you to get down, get the fuck down. All right? Don't resist. Don't try to hawk up. Don't try to run. Don't try to be a tough guy against the a cowboy, none of that. You know, it's a reason why, you know, the Lord said to do these things because he knew what was going to be the outcome of it, all right? And in these times that's coming, you're going to want to call upon the names of your your, your power, okay? Yahweh, who wordingly calls God, Baha Shem, which means in the name, Yahweh Shah, okay? Who wordingly calls Jesus Christ. Because I had watched a lesson from my brother. I'm not sure. I forgot what that brother's name is. And it, it moved me. You know, it really, really moved me. Because this brother, here it is. He's about to be faced with death. And Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, delivered, delivered that brother. Okay, so it's power behind those names. All right? But to the situation at hand, because you're going to have a lot of jig out there that's acting like niggas. And then they're going to want to call upon the, the, the names. That you didn't just gave these officers hell and they telling now they down they roughing you up and stuff like that. So it's a reason why we are telling you to agree with your adversary. Your adversary is the you know the it's self-explanatory who the adversary is. Okay? This is Matthew chapter five and verse twenty-five. Right? Agree with our adversary quickly whilst thou art in the way with him. Okay. So police come up to your car. As you can see by the picture right here, you see the police is coming up to his car and everything. Probably told him to get down a few times, you know, but you know how our people is. You know, they're stubborn, they're stiff-necked, they're hard-headed. You know, they always got a point they, they, wanna, they don't want to consider to be weak. You know, a messed up state of mind, per se. Okay? Because when you agree with your adversary, you never know. That Yahweh Bashim Al Shah could put the spirit on on, his, on your adversary, you know, to let you go. Could could put the spirit on these police officers, you know, whoever it may be, to let you go. All right. At least at any time, the adversary delivered thee to the judge. All right, and I'm pretty sure any Akim Agwa, you know, that may have been locked up, know you know how the process goes. Okay, police come get you. You get locked up. You got to sit and wait to see a commissioner. And, you know, you, you in here. It's like every man's for itself. Your mind is racing. And you sitting there thinking, damn, if only I ain't do this. If only I ain't do that. Well, to avoid all that from happening, because now you got these police officers now, and they got that shoot to kill because they have that tactical fear. They're very fearful of Jake. So these officers, you know, so-called white men, you know, with his, with, his, with his E, you know, he already has that perpetual hatred in his heart for, for, for Jake. So you just giving him a reason is just going to add the fuel to the fire. All right? 
he already wants to destroy us as it is, you know, because of the whole birthright situation. But you being a nigga and fuck you, I ain't doing shit and running away. You're just adding a reason for him to pop your ass. Okay? Because a lot of situations, sometimes I feel like they can be avoided. But, you know, Jake don't use the knowledge that was given to them. They want to be a hood nigga or, you know, want to do things the, the, the diabolical way. All right? And thou, okay... And, and the judge deliver thee to the officer. And thou be cast into prison. Who the fuck wants to... It's a lock in my word choice. But who wants to get locked up? Who wants to sit in prison and, 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 and somebody tell you when you can go out? You know, feed you when you want. Shower up when they allow you to. You're in a cage. Your freedom is deprived from you. You know, things that you used to have right now. And, I mean, I know it's a lot of, you know, you have brothers that's been locked up for different time periods, so they might be institutionalized, so they might do something to get locked back up because all they know. That situation is a lot different from what I'm talking about. If you, like, for instance, you, you see four Jakes rolling down the street in a nice car, okay? And then you can see four, you know, Edomites rolling down the street in a nice car, all right? These Edomites had might have dope crack and all that on them. These these four Jakes might don't have anything on them. Might be just really legitimate brothers that work hard, but they just wanted to go out. Now, do you believe do you do you think the adversary is gonna mess with them or they're gonna mess with the brothers? They're gonna mess with the brothers, you know why? Because they know that that temper. And they don't like to see our they don't want to see our people do well. Okay? But you best to believe a normal situation. Well, four guys just going out there to relax is going to turn into a very bloody, nasty situation. All right? These killings, you know, of, 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 of the, of the so-called black man is only going to intensify. Okay? While the knowledge of the how Bashima was shot in the scriptures is, is increasing all over the planet Earth, you know, you have different brothers that's turning their head. And a lot of these, these put-downs, sorry to say, is judgment, too. All right. You know, that's why the whole Black Lives Matters campaign is a bunch of bullshit. How can you how can you be out there riding and protesting when one person gets killed by, a, a, you know, by a, a white officer, per se. But you want to you going to the next day go out there and kill your own brother. And you best to believe a lot of those members uh, those black those, those Black Life Matter campaigns are the same individuals that's killing their own brother on a daily basis. So that's some hypocritical ass shit. You know? At the end of the day, the only lies that matters to me is the nation of Israel, the elect. That's what matters to me. You know? Fuck them heathens and everybody else. I can care less about what happens, you know, to an Edomite or anything. You know, I, I can care less. My job... Is to, to, to worry about the elect and, and, and to warn my people. That's it. Because you might have this this lesson might reach out to a brother and a brother might think and be like, oh, I think about the Akim said, so let me just agree. They tell me to get out the car, I'm gonna get out the car, put my hands on my back. Because ironically, so I had a dream that and it felt so real. It kind of scared me that I was about to be, you know, put down. You know, and it's crazy because it was, you know, a brother. From the tribe of Issachar, you know, guns all in my, my face. And I can't remember what it is that I did, if I did anything in, in general. But, I, I, well, you know, it's crazy. The only thing that kept coming to my mind is agree with our adversary. And even though it was a dream and everything, I still was able to maneuver and get out that situation. You know? So, it's, it's a reason why, in these words, when you look on Matthew chapter verse, I mean, chapter 5... The words are in red because Yahweh Shah is speaking. All right. Agree with our adversaries. You see it just the pitching right here. You see they got to, you know, they tell you put your hands up. License and registration. Don't be no nigga, man. Just do it. That nigga, you know, that that niggerish mindset is going to lead to death, man. All right. It's going to lead to this. You see the outcome? All right. Do you see the outcome of, of what happens to you when you don't listen, all right? 
We're in the land. We're in the, we're in the land of captivity. Okay? So there is a particular race of people, nation of people that's ruling over us. Okay? So the best thing we can do if they tell us to get out the car, get out the car. Turn your engine off. All right? Ask for your license and registration. Give them the shit. You know, put your hands behind your back. Just put your hands behind your fucking back. All right? You make matters worse for yourself, you know, when you when you resist the rest. Okay? To take you to jail, man, you, public, you know, um, commissioner that you see, you know, man, you never know, man. Police might just let you go, man. Lord can, can put a spread on them officers. It's about to take you to jail. It's out of nowhere, stop you, and let you go. Right? It can happen. All right? And it will happen. But predicaments like this, as you see in this picture, is going to intensify because our people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. All right? They reject the knowledge of Yahweh by Shema So you're going, to, you're going to see this. I just try to figure out, you know, what is so hard about turning off your engine, put your hands behind your back, shutting the fuck up. What is so hard about that? You know, but Jake wants to go on and on and on and on and on like they have a point to prove. And if 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 death is the new thing that's popping now, you know, that's the new trend dying today, y'all can have that shit. You feel me? Because your how about Shema was shy, man, you know, he's gonna get us through. And I'm not really the per se the the, the crying type. But just hearing that brother's testimony, man, it really set me, you know, it, it, it made me emotional. Because I think about the different times I was delivered and I wasn't even in the truth. You know? So call Allah Yahweh Bashim Yahweh man. Call Allah Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Call Allah Yahweh Bashim Yahweh You know? For giving us this this knowledge. All right? I'm going to read it one more time and I'm going to end it. Agree with our adversary quickly whilst thou art in the way with him. Least. At any time, the adversary delivered thee to the judge, and the judge delivered thee to the officer, and thou be cast in prison. All right? To avoid those situations, agree with our adversary quickly. All right? All right? I'm going to say it one more time. Agree with our adversary quickly. I hope this video was edifying. I hope it hits the hearts and the mind. But I hope for a lack out there, wherever you may be scattered at, man. You know, police pull you over. You know, just agree. Do what it is they say so you can have another so you can have another chance at living, man. You don't want to die being hit 15, 14 times because you didn't want to put your hands behind your back. Because these police officers now are shooting to kill, man. Whether it be black or white, they're shooting to kill. Alright? So like I said, I hope this video is edifying. Giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shah. Baha Shemra Kakadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS that do well. Peace, love, hope, and salutations to the hopeful elect that scattered across the four corners of the earth. All right? Apparatus Zot. No, Shalom.